So if you're on a Mac and you are using iMovie, it can be frustrating because it sits on your computer's hard drive and can get very, very big and then use up all the storage on your Mac. So if you're watching this, it's because you wanna look at getting that iMovie library off your computer and onto some sort of external media, a USB drive, a USB external hard drive. Very, very easy to do. We're gonna show you how to do that today. Before we do this, why don't you click on the subscription button on the bell? I release videos every single week on all things tech, including a lot of stuff on the Mac. So click on that button so that you don't miss out on anything that we are releasing. You're gonna need three things. One, a Mac computer. Two, an iMovie library. Whether that's a brand new iMovie library or one that's already got a whole bunch of videos on there. And three, an external hard drive, external USB stick of some sort. Now number three, of course, being that drive, you need it to be big enough. Pick up yourself an external hard drive, external USB drive that is large enough to be able to store a lot of data over a lot of time. Let's now move over to the Mac and we'll show you how to actually point your iMovie to an external drive. First thing is to actually open up the Finder here on your computer. You're gonna be listed with this area right here. We're gonna go into Movies and right here is where your iMovie library sits. You can easily expand this to see how big this is. And right now my movies library is 17.98 gig and I don't have very much space. Look at that, I've got 17.2 gig free on my Mac and that's not very good. So we wanna get that off our computer and onto an external hard drive. You'll also notice that I've got a hard drive here. Here it is. This is the untitled hard drive. This is the hard drive that you're gonna plug into the side of your computer, making sure that it is big enough to be able to store all of the iMovie video content. Now, you have to remember, of course, that iMovie content is going to grow and grow and grow. So get yourself a USB hard drive that is big enough with intended growth considered when you are putting that one into your computer. Then the next thing we wanna do is we wanna copy these two files, iMovie Library and iMovie Theater. We're gonna click on our command and select both of those. We're going to right click and select copy. You can also do Command C to do a copy as well. Once those are copied, you go into your hard drive that you've connected. I'm gonna go and create a new folder in here just to make it a little bit cleaner. And I'm gonna say iMovie library, like so. And that's where I'm actually going to go and paste those two files, paste right in there. Now what we're doing right here is we're just copying the iMovie library over. Once it is copied over, you can then go and delete your old iMovie library. And then we need to point your iMovie to the new location. And that is the trick right there. And then iMovie will remember where to find your iMovie library on your external hard drive, your USB drive going forward. So the iMovie library is now copied over. The next step is now to go and open up iMovie, but we're gonna be holding a specific key down on your keyboard as you open it up. Here is iMovie. Now what we wanna do is we're gonna hold down the option key on your keyboard and then double click on the iMovie. Continue to hold that option key when you click on it. What should pop up is right here, it says open library. Which library would you like to open? So this is the iMovie library that you know and love, but we don't wanna to point to that one. We now wanna to point to the new library which you've copied over to the hard drive. So you're gonna select locate right in there. We now navigate to our USB stick, go into iMovie library and select iMovie library right over there. Select open that is now using the iMovie library from your USB hard drive. Just to double check, you can hold down the option key again and open up iMovie. And you'll notice that there are two iMovies right there. There is the old one on your Macintosh hard drive and your new one sitting here on your untitled USB drive. You can now go and safely delete the iMovie library. Now, double checking, triple checking that that iMovie library has been copied correctly to your USB drive. If you've accidentally deleted your iMovie library and you can't get it back and you didn't copy it over correctly, not too good news. And if the iMovie library has been copied over correctly, you can then go and select those two right over there. You can right click on them and you could move them to your bin or to your trash. So there you have it, that is all done. iMovie should now be on external media. Why don't you let us know down below in the comments how you went, whether it worked, whether it didn't work. Oh, and hey, remember to click on that subscription button on the bell. I release videos every week on tech. I know you'll find them helpful. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time.